This is Chris the Idaho Painter here on Paint Live TV. Today I'm going to be talking about the Outpack Paint Station. It's a new product and I'm going to give you three reasons why you should use this product on your job site. So stay tuned for this video. So today's video is brought to you by Paint Life Gear. You can find our shirts, hats, and all of our tools and accessories on our website at theidahopainter.com. Theidahopainter.com for all of our really cool shirts and hats. Go check it out after you watch this video. But the first thing I'm going to talk about is looking professional on the job site. This Outpack Paint Station is one of those ways that you can do that. And I'm very big on looking professional on the job site at all times. It's one of the reasons why I wear a hat. I think wearing a hat gives you a professional look. It's why I don't allow our paint clothes on our crew or myself to get too overly dirty. I want to look professional at all times. I think this product, the Outpack Paint Station, is one of those things that is going to give you that professional look. Now you can set your sprayer inside this thing and it's got this box, this containment system, and we are doing a lot of residential repaints, interior and exterior. If you're on the outside of a house, you have cars driving by, you have people walking down the sidewalks. It's a very professional look if people see your tools or your products inside a box like this. It's orange, it has this nice professional look that says, hey, there's something important sitting inside here. Don't get near it, you can knock it over or dump it over. So it looks professional to the people walking by. It looks very professional to your customer when they see your tools and products inside this, even on the outside of your house, on the inside of your house, it gives you that professional look at all times too. So great, great way to look professional. I'm very big on that. And now we'll talk about building customer confidence with this product. So when you're inside and outside of a job site, and we'll talk about outside first, if I'm working outside and I have my paint sprayer sitting inside of a box like this, we're typically uh, outside of a house, it's painting the exterior, you're gonna have neighbors walking down the sidewalk you're gonna have people driving down the streets and this orange box is a great way to build confidence to the neighbors and also to the homeowner itself that you're containing your products you don't want anybody near the products and stuff that there's things in here that could spill or things that could you know cause harm so inside the house there's a lot more liability inside the house especially with carpeted floors and other types of floors with if paint spilled it could get on the floor now of course as a professional painter if paint spilled you know I would be liable and I would take care of it but a customer when they walk by and they see your paint tray or your airless sprayer or whatever equipment sitting inside here, they just have the confidence that you're taking care of the property. You're a professional painter and that if something happens, it's gonna be contained inside here. I'm very big on building customer confidence. Customer confidence goes a long ways. I mean, eventually these customers, they've gotta trust you. They're gonna go away and possibly give you the keys, give you the garage code and leave, go to work and trust that you're gonna act professional and do the right thing inside their house and treat their property with respect. This is a simple way of giving them the confidence that you're respecting the property and you're acting as a professional painter should. Okay, the third reason why you should use the Outpack Paint Station is it's a great tool that will help you contain your equipment and contain your products according to EPA regulations. Now, here in Boise, Idaho, we have um, the EPA, which is an environmental protection agency, and they have all kinds of rules and regulations when it comes to containing and disposing of products. In some states, like California, they're a lot more strict and stringent on the rules and regulations and this device will help you abide by some of those rules and regulations. Now check in other countries, they could even be more strict or less strict, but look at the rules and regulations. It's a great tool for containing your products and even cleaning your tools in, inside here and disposing of it according to those rules and regulations. So you might be wondering what we actually use this thing for. So we gave you the three reasons why you use it. Now let's talk about 
how we use it. And one of the things I really like this is for is secondary containment. I can take a large sprayer or even a small sprayer and I can set it inside this box. So the sprayer will be here and our paint cans will be in here. So if anything spills, it's contained right inside this box, inside this leak proof plastic. And if anything leaks on the sprayer, if any oil or throat seal leaks or any paint leaks, it's contained inside here. Another great thing about having a sprayer inside here is this has a bottom and it's two layers of cardboard so if there's any type of vibration of the sprayer on say a hardwood floor it's not going to scratch your hardwood floor so it's great sprayer containment Another thing is, is when the sprayer is inside here, if a customer walks by and they see your sprayer contained inside this box, it's all orange, the, the customer knows, hey, there's something I need to stay away from. It just builds customer confidence that you're respecting and taking care of their property. So secondary containment is very important and this solves that problem. So the next use we're gonna talk about is using the Outpack paint station as a floor shield. So it's perforated on the edges, I can cut it on the edge, and then I can fold this down, and now I have myself a shield that I can butt up against my baseboard or skirting, and I can roll my walls, and any type of splatter is gonna hit the box. So I can set an 18 inch pan or a nine inch pan right inside the box right here, and I can roll out of it. And if I'm in a large, say like commercial area, this box can slide along the floor, slide along your skirting baseboard or your wall, and you can roll, and any splatter is gonna hit the box shield right here. It does have notches on the, on the sides right here. There's three notches and a roller extension pole or the, the roller itself can set right in there and now it's stabilized and won't slide from side to side. Your roller is sitting inside here, your pan and your bucket. It's got the nice box, notifies people that, hey, there's something inside here, don't step in it. We've all stepped in a nine inch pan, a roller tray once in our career at some point in time. This is a great device that will keep you from doing that. So great little paint shield when you're rolling walls. Once again, you can just slide along the floor and roll right along. So the next use I wanna talk about is cleaning your tools. And at the end of the day, if you need a place to clean your tools, and that you know, abides by rules and regulations for EPA standards, this is a great device. Once again, it's leak-proof plastic. You can take and clean your sprayer inside here. I can have my sprayer sitting outside. I can run all the contaminated water, dirty water, right inside here. It does come with a product called Slurry Solution. It comes with a sample pack, and this stuff, you just add it to the liquid, and it solidifies the liquid. Then you can just roll up the bag, and you can dispose it at the landfill. Now, now you want to definitely check with your rules and regulations where you're at if this is um, good enough and if this abides by the rules and regulations and standards to be disposed of where I live this works and I can take it to the landfills and it's no longer hazardous or contaminated waste I can clean my rollers inside here I can clean my brushes inside here all the dirty water dirty liquid is contained inside the box add my slurry solution roll it up and dispose of it so there you have it, three uses and three reasons why you should use the Outpack Paint Station. Hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please give me a thumbs up. Hit the notification bell. If you hit that little notification bell, it will notify you every time we come out with a new video. It's simple, easy to do, and it's free. If you got any questions or comments, leave them down below. We love to hear what you have to say. If you got any questions or comments about this, if you've used it, leave them down below. We'd love to hear what you have to say. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video. If you have, we'll see you hopefully on our next video. Out.